Hi everyone. Today I am going to explain uh, uh, to find the factorial number using for loop in Linux. So here a set of statements I am I written uh, in the Linux terminal to find out the factorial number. So uh, here eight lines program I written here. So let us we discuss line by line to find out the factorial number here. So first I written the echo command. Echo command will helps to print the set of statements here so for that purpose i used a uh, echo command so in uh, followed by the echo command i return a statement to enter a number any programmer should understood to enter the value to find out the factorial number here so after that the programmer uh, reading the line to enter a number so they will enter the value for the num variable you just consider programmer is I entered the value 5 so it will be stored in the variable it will be stored in the variable and readed by the read command which is helpful to scan the input uh, inserted by the programmer here so it like uh, act as a scanner okay whether you learned in uh, C itself so here fact is a variable equal sign is a very uh, assignment operator and one is the variable uh, value so every time the fact uh, it will starts from one itself so in the next line i use the for loop uh, simultaneous uh, iteration to find out the factorial number so for loop consisting three different parts the first part is uh, in a initialization part second part comparison part and the third part is called as increment part increment part so when uh, the problem it will uh, checks in the for loops iteratively or simultaneously so it will check the initial part i is equal to 2 so then it will compare to the given uh, input by the programmer so i is 2 now so num is 5 so i is less than 5 the conditional it, it will gets true so in, uh, the loop enters into the logical part so this logical part will multiplies the given i value with fact uh, fact value so the fact value is 1 i value is 1 so then it will come so 1 when the i value is 2 the fact value is 1 so the output uh, result it will it holds a 2 so when it will uh, comes to the third term third term so i is 2 i is 2 so uh, i is 3 i is 3 the obtained result is obtained result is 2 so it is multiplied by value that is 2 into 3 the uh, result it will uh, uh, you will get 6 so that the result it will hold in fact so then it will uh, uh, increment the value in the fourth term fourth term so 4 is less than 5 the condition gets true so whatever the obtained result is holded in the factorial value so it will be multiplied by the fourth term or fourth iteration so then you will get the 24 value so again it will uh, 24 it, it will stored in the fact value so again the increment takes place uh, in the term phi becomes the term uh, uh, iteration it becomes phi so phi is not less than phi but here we use the uh, equal sign so phi is equal to phi the condition it will get true so obtained result is 24 24 into fifth term it will be multiplied and you will get the result 20 120 so here in the last line we uh, whatever the resultant we find it by the logical part so it will be printed with the help of echo command in the in this program so let us we see the uh, program execution first you should uh, press the escape key to go to the command mode so when you will get uh, escape mode so you should press the uh, colon wq so this command it will helps to save and exit from the vi editor so then it will come to the terminal ubuntu terminal or command mode so you should change the permission change mode is a command where uh, it will uh, 
provide the permissions to the uh, file created file so here we used an uh, 777 logical uh, number to give all the permissions to the file so for this uh, by using this uh, command you will get the permission to the created file so enter press enter then you should follow the uh, absolute path to run the program okay so then you press enter you just add, enter the five value so 120 is the result so this what the output you got please like share and subscribe my channel